Hello and welcome back to 5 Minute Geography with me Stephen Doyle. Each week I'll be uploading a 5 minute video explaining as simply as possible the world around us. Today in 5 Minute Geography we look at what exactly is thunder and lightning. And don't forget to stick around to the end of the video for a shocking fact about thunder. A big thank you to Mandy for suggesting this topic. Thunder, very simply, is the sound caused by lightning. When a lightning bolt travels from the cloud to the ground, it actually opens up a little hole in the air called a channel. Once the light is gone, the air collapses back and creates a sound wave that we know as thunder. The reason we see lightning before we hear thunder is simply because light waves travel faster than sound. Thunderstorms develop when the atmosphere is unstable. This is when warm air exists underneath much colder air. As the warm air rises, it cools and condenses, forming small droplets of water. If there is enough instability in the air, the updraft of warm air is rapid and the water vapour will quickly form a cumulonimbus cloud. These cumulonimbus clouds can form rapidly, typically in under an hour. As the warm air continues to rise, the water droplets merge together to create larger droplets, which freeze to form ice crystals. As a result of circulating air in the clouds, water freezes on the surface of the droplets to crystallise. Eventually these droplets become too heavy to be supported by the updraft of air and they fall, typically as hail. As hail moves within the cloud, it picks up negative charges by rubbing against smaller positively charged ice crystals. A negative charge forms at the base of the cloud where the hail collects, while the lighter ice crystals remain near the top of the cloud and create a positive charge. The negative charge is attracted to the Earth's surface. When the attraction becomes too strong, the positive and the negative charges come together or discharge to balance the difference in a flash of lightning, sometimes known as a lightning strike or a lightning bolt. This rapid expansion and the heating of the air caused by the lightning produces a very loud clap of thunder. Thunderstorms are common occurrences on Earth. It's estimated that a lightning strike hits somewhere on the Earth's surface approximately 44 times every second. A total of nearly 1.4 billion lightning strikes happen every year. Because of the fact thunderstorms are created by intense heating of the Earth's surface, they are most common in areas of the globe where the water is hot and humid. Land masses, therefore, experience more storms than the oceans, and thunderstorms are also more frequent in tropical areas than they are at higher latitudes. Lightning is a bright flash of electricity produced by a thunderstorm. All thunderstorms produce lightning and can be dangerous. If you hear the sound of thunder, then you know lightning is not far behind. You can use thunder to tell you how far away a storm is. So the next time you see a storm, count the number of seconds between when you see the lightning and hear the thunder. Take the number of seconds and divide that by five, and that will tell you how far away the storm is in miles. For example, if you counted 15 seconds between the lightning and the thunder, the lightning would be three miles away. Lightning injures more people every year than hurricanes or tornadoes. On average, between 75 to 100 people every year. Lightning is approximately 54,000 degrees Fahrenheit, and that is six times hotter than the surface of the sun. As always, I've been Stephen Doyle with 5 Minute Geography. Please hit the like and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on any future content. And if you'd like me to cover a specific topic, please just pop it in the comment section below.